In this example, we're going to look at writing an exponential growth model given information about the starting population and the growth rate in a particular situation. So in this example, we are told the population of a city is 22,395 and the growth rate of this population is 6.2 percent per year and that this is a fairly consistent rate of growth. I'm going to start out by writing down the information I know and hopefully it will be helpful in creating the model. So I know that the growth rate, R, we're going to call that R, is 6.2 percent. I'm going to write that as a decimal dividing by 100 to get 0 0.062. The initial population is 22,395. So the formula that we have used in the past to write models for population growth is P of T equals A B to the T. That's our exponential growth or decay model. In this case we don't know B. So I'm going to rewrite the form of this equation so that I can factor in the information I do know which is R. So I can determine B by adding the value of our growth rate in decimal form to the number 1. If I do that I get the model P of T equals 22,395 times 1.062 to the t. Once I have my model, I can use it to predict the population at different stages in time. So particularly for part b in 2006, 2006 minus my start time of 2001 is five years. So to find the population in 2006, I need to compute P of 5. I do that by computing 22,395 times 1.062 to the fifth. So let's plug that into our calculators and see what we get. So 22,395 times 1.062 raised to the fifth power equals, and I have that number there, I want to round that to the nearest person. If I do that, I'm going to get 30,253 people that are in this city in 2006.